is Allie from Color and Plan with Allie, and um, I hope that you'll bear with me today. I may be kind of coughing a lot and have a little bit of, um, you know, gunk in my throat. I'm still, <coughs> excuse me, there I go. I'm still kind of somewhat recovering from COVID, and I have a horrible, like, dry cough, so um, I'm going to try to keep this video short, sweet, and to the point, but I wanted to show you guys my gel pen collection, and this is actually also going to be short because I don't actually have that many gel pens. So what you see in front of you right here is my collection of Sakura Jelly Rolls. Um, I have way more of these white gel pens than anything else, but they're all, like, kind of scattered. Like, I bought tons of them just so I could keep them with, like every pencil set I own, um, or that I have in a case that I like to take with me. And then a lot of these came from, I'll link it down in the description below. A lot of these came from that big, like, 74 or 72 pack of jelly rolls that you can buy on Amazon, which I will link below. These are my Stardust. These are by far my favorite of the jelly rolls. They are believe a glitter. I'm not going to write on myself. Let me grab a piece of paper. So yeah, they, uh, they are glitter. I'm trying to get it to catch the light. There we go. And I use these all the time for like little details and stuff that I want to be very sparkly. Um, I like drawing or coloring rainbows with these. Always fun. And I also have these are like the ones where when you write with them, let me scribble a little bit, and then they dry, they have like a gold or silver outline. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but yeah, I have several of these, just various colors that came in that pack. Um, I think, I'm not sure what they call these. But yeah, here's another one. And there's another one like that. I have several of them. That's a, I think this is a clear Stardust, which is always handy to have because it will go clear over anything, any color that you have laid down. And these are the metallic ones. And I absolutely love these as well. And I also have a bunch of the Moonlights in several different sizes. Like I have the tins, and then I also have the um, sixes and these are super great for working with black paper and I also have just the classic jelly rolls I have the gray moon lights I love all things neutral colored I also have souffles I think those are the ones that kind of leave like a puffy look to them and I also have the glazes these leave like I mean, it's kind of what it says. It looks like a raised, very shiny, glossy look when you write with those. And I think those are all the different types that I have. And, you know, you can see all these different colors that I own. Like I said, most of these came from that big 70 pack or whatever it was that you can get on Amazon. And then I went and bought the extra colors of the Moonlights and thus the glazes and souffles separately. So these are my Sakura Jelly Rolls. I have another big bucket of gel pens for you guys, and these are not like in any sort of order or anything, but I have two different sets of budget gel pens in here, and one of them is the AN Art 100 piece glitter set, which I will also, will also link below. Um, and there's a hundred different colors of these, and I love them, like, let me go grab a picture that I did with those. So, here is the picture that I did with the a and glitter. I absolutely love how it came out, and I actually blended them here to get the ombre effect. But yeah, this is her, um, Sun and Moon Mandela's book, Camellia and Jacoba. But I really love the way that they go down. They are very easy to work with and they blend like a dream. And then I also have, this is the last set of gel pens that I have, the Tanmit, I think that's how you say it, the 240 set. And then they send you like this gigantor box of 
which open refills to go with them. And there are, I want to say like 120 actual gel pens, but they call it like, the product description says 240 um, because it's including the refill. But it comes with all different kinds, like some are neon and this D, I'm not sure what it means like on the code, but they are all labeled, which is great. Most gel pens aren't like the A and ones. Those. The A and Art ones I had to like, I don't even know if you can see that. And some of it's probably rubbing off, but I had to label them myself with silver Sharpie. But these you do not have to label yourself, which makes it really easy to work with them. Especially if you have them out on a swatch chart, you can pick exactly the colors you need and find them really easily. I'm trying to find like a different stuff. Like these are glitter neon, I think is the, what the GN means. And metallic. And we have neon pastel, all kinds of different stuff. But I will link both of these sets below. I haven't had any issues working with these. I think they are a great value for what you pay for them. I think I paid like $20 for the 100 set of a and Art and for the Tan Mint. I think it was just a little over 20. Them are a great deal. You'll pay a lot less than what you would pay for these bad boys. And in some cases you get more variety, but I love the jelly rolls and how vibrant and consistent their pens are, which is why I have them. So, but yeah, that, that's a pretty short, straight to the point video. That is pretty much my gel pen collection. I mean, with the exception of like the gel pens I keep on my desk, like for writing, but those are like my coloring gel pens. And I'll, I'll go over like when I decide to one day do my stationery video, I'll show you guys all the stationery I have. It's pretty, it's a, it's a problem. As if any of you are stationary addicts, you know it's a problem. <laughs> but I hope that you enjoyed this video. And like I said, all of the products that I mentioned or showed you will be linked in the description below. And they are affiliate links, which helps my channel at no additional cost to you if you want to use them. Um, and I hope that you have a wonderful, colorful day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!